Hello. Today I'll be talking about the world's first dissolvable smartwatch prototype. Transient electronics are an emerging class of electronics with the unique characteristic to completely dissolve within a programmed period of time. Since no harmful byproducts are released, these electronics can be used in the human body as a diagnostic tool for instance or they can be used as environmentally friendly alternative to existing electronics which disintegrate when exposed to water. Transient electronics that can disintegrate on demand could help stem the rising tide of electronic waste but their performance is often inferior to conventional devices. Now scientists in China have developed what may be the first dissolvable smartwatch, a prototype that performs much like a conventional smartwatch. Advances in electronics over the decades have led to explosive growth in their use with global sales of consumer electronics reaching more than 1 trillion dollar in 2019. However, continuously replacing outdated devices with new versions also generate more than 53.6 million tons of electronic waste per year. Recycling can help deal with some e-waste, but small electronics such as smartwatches and fitness trackers are not easily dismantled or recycled. Previously, the researchers developed a composite material made using zinc nanoparticles that dissolved in water for use in temporary circuits. However, it was not electrically conductive enough for consumer electronics. In the new study, scientists modified their zinc-based nanocomposite by adding silver nanowires which boosted its electrical conductivity. They next printed the metallic solution onto pieces of a polymer that degrades in water. They then sintered the circuits together by applying small droplets of water that support chemical reaction and then evaporate. Using this approach, the researchers created a smartwatch with multiple nanocomposite, printed circuit boards inside a 3D printed water degradable polymer case. The device had sensors that accurately measured heart rates, blood oxygen levels and step counts and transmitted this data to a mobile phone app via a Bluetooth connection just like conventional smartwatches. Its OLED screen could display data such as date, time and messages from linked mobile phones as well as wearer life signs it monitored. The smartwatch exterior could resist sweat but once the whole device was fully immersed in water, the case and circuits dissolved completely within 40 hours. All that remained were components such as OLED screen and microcontroller as well as resistors and capacitors formally integrated into the circuits. The researchers also noted the new composites are bioresorbable, meaning they can dissolve in the body and display much better electrical and mechanical performance than other bioresorbable inks. As such, they may lead to printable and implantable devices that can disappear in the human body after completing their functions. Most bioresorbable electronic devices are fabricated using CMOS process, which is very time consuming and demand many special processes. In contrast, devices made with these nanocomposite can get mass produced via printing with much less cost, energy, and higher yields and throughputs, suggesting they could readily get incorporated into existing production lines of electric circuits. In the future, these scientists plan on creating more kinds of transient devices using their nanocomposites. One challenge in creating practical transient electronics is optimizing the properties of their packaging materials to match the degradation rates of the circuits. But the introduction of extra packaging materials is not a big issue, as wearable and portable electronics need to be packaged anyway to improve their reliability. The scientists recently detailed their findings in the journal ACS Applied Materials and Interfaces. That's all for now. Thank you for watching.